What can be more exciting than a new car brand being launched? So, welcome to Polestar. This is the imaginatively called Polestar 1 model. Yes, I know what you're thinking. Looks a little bit like a Volvo. That's because Polestar is the performance brand of the Volvo family. Now, this car started life as a Volvo two years ago, and then Volvo CEO Hawk and Samuelson said, do you know what? This shouldn't be a Volvo, it should be something very, very separate. Now, those eagle-eyed amongst you will recognise it from the Volvo Concept Coupe from as far away as 2013 at the Frankfurt Motor Show, and the car hasn't changed much. It looks superb. A lot of those lovely Volvo touches, the Thor Hammer front lights, C-shaped rear lights as well. But the grille is all Polestar, and it features new Polestar badging. Inside is very much Volvo again with Polestar badging and had a few little imaginative touches like a Polestar logo that shines up like a star onto the glass roof. Now, under the skin, as you'd expect from a company like Volvo, tech leaders, it's Polestar brand is doing the same and this car is part electric, part petrol. It's a petrol electric performance hybrid. Performance is the key. This car with its combination of three electric motors and its engine will produce 592 brake horsepower and wait for it, a thousand newton meters of torque. This car is going to be seriously quick. Volvo promises a sub four second 0 to 60 time but this is about being a driver's car as somebody at Polestar told me earlier it's about what it feels like the first time you turn into a corner it's a sports car but it's still a GT it's got to go long distances that's probably why they didn't go full electric just yet so when can you buy one of these well believe it or not we stand here in October 2017 the factory hasn't been built yet the stone hasn't been turned but this car the first one will be rolling out of that factory in the first quarter of 2019. Price? Well, Polestar is going to be selling this car on a subscription basis. Of course, if you want to put some cash down, you'll be able to, but most people will buy a subscription that covers everything from the maintenance and concierge service and all those luxury items you get. But ballpark figure, around £130,000. A lot of money for a car like this but it's doing a big job. It's a halo model for a whole range of Polestar models coming. In 2019, we'll see the first Polestar 2, which will be a Tesla 3 rivaling saloon car. Then in 2020, we'll see a Polestar SUV, a low slung, sleek, coupe-like SUV, we suspect. Both those cars will go on sale a year later. So, this is Polestar. Let us know what you think in the comments section below.